What's up everybody, it's your boy. Here are some videos of Harold Davenport. <laughs> Harold, you like your box? <laughs> Harold, box. All right, now that you're done with that, um, I have to tell you guys a story. No, I don't. Um. Oh wait, I found that broken void cube on the floor at my school, and I put it in my backpack. It was way less broken than this, and you could actually tell it was a void cube. And you could actually tell it was a void cube at the time, but I guess it broke apart in my backpack. Here's what it's here's what it's supposed to look like. Um, so yeah, I've always wondered how these worked, because there wasn't a middle, and usually the whole mechanism was in the middle of the cube. And it turns out they just use it on the- turns out they just use it on the sides. Turns- Alright, well, it's- the only main bit I have now is this, since I tried to show you guys how the- how to, By the way, the reason why I say guys and not a gender neutral name is because, like, all of the people are my, who watch my videos are male. Like, actually, if I check my analytics, like, right now, I'll say, like, 98% of my viewers are male. And, like, those other 2% who are female, I feel very bad for you. Don't watch my video. Nobody should watch my videos. They're not even good. Go watch, like, Austin McConnell. He's cool. Watch him. Um... Oh! No, never mind. Um. Yeah. I know. Hey, you guys wanna watch me do a- do a thing? Watch. Alright, hold on. It's almost done. Whoa, it's like in a checkerboard pattern now. Hey now, I'm magic. The funny thing is, I only know how to do one side. And so I'm really afraid to mix this up, because if I did learn how to do one side, it'd probably still be really hard, because this stuff is- because this doesn't have a middle piece, and that's the main thing that you need to solve a Rubik's Cube in the beginner method. Uh, 